Hey, Victor Vance. Wow, did anyone ever tell you you got a really dumb name? No, no one's ever oh, mentioned that before. Oh my, look at that. Hey, is that legal? Can animals give consent? I don't know. Listen, Jerry, can you stash that weed somewhere weed? else? What weed? <laughs> I'm shitting with you. Come on, having fun. Rock and roll. Oh, would you fucking relax, my friend? Look, I'm not some idiot that you can just... I never called you an idiot. <sighs> oh, shh, shh. Look at that. Oh. Oh, now she got a pig and a horse. Hooey. <laughs> that candy sucks. <laughs> That's some guy's daughter, man. Listen, Jerry. No, you listen, huh? Oh, dude. Will you look at that? Man, I gotta get laid. Oh, jeez. Hey. If you weren't such a square, I'd do you, huh? <laughs> I'm joking, come on. This is the army, not the navy, huh? <laughs> hey, listen, man, I need a broad, huh? Oh, I need Mary. Mary, yeah. Oh, Mary, Mary, quite contrary. <laughs> oh, come on, man, I need a favor. I need you to collect your pot, dude. Sure, I'll go get that from your quarters. You go get married for me, okay? She's over at Vice Port. Oh, and go see Phil again. He says something about a gift for you. Huh? I don't trust you, Martinez. Hey, that is not an appropriate way to speak to a superior officer. <laughs> now get on with it, come on. The reefer is under my bed. Oh, genius. Great hiding place. What are you, 15? Huh, hurry up. Oh, hey, and tell Mary I love her. Fucking idiot. Oh. Oh. Woo! Woo! Watch your AOR, son! Hey, who's committing this atrocity, anywho? Hey, it's refusing, little peasants! The scum, they want food! And not to be whipped! I mean, who ever heard of such a thing? They are peasants, monsieur, and as such we must kiss on them! And now they have got to the heads of too many people! It is a tragedy! Hey, Vic, how you doing? Martinez wanted me to give you this. Don't worry, it's Don Traceful. Don't worry? Man, I'm getting too deep into this shit. Things in nature look like reproductive organs. Do you know Mary? If you want Mary, she's at a party up on Starfish. I'm heading over there myself. You can give me a lift. I'm Mona, by the way. If there's anything I can do for you, or to you, just let me know. This is the show for you. shows have started up with no respect for politic persuasion. No understanding that a real man doesn't need to see the world to have an opinion on it. And certainly doesn't need to meet foreigners to know they are up to no good. The world is a beautiful place. Let's make sure it stays there. 
by controlling it properly. But how do we do that? Well, first, by one-sided diatribes on the airwaves. Thanks for the ride, rugged fella. Maybe I can pay you back in kind later? I just need to find Mary. Sure. She's right over there. Are you Mary? Come on, let's go. Hey, we paid for her. She's not going anywhere. Is that a fact? Damn right. Come on. Let's get this low-life nobody and teach this bitch a lesson, too. Yeah, let's do this. Take it easy, muscles. I've got a delicate disposition. Say it in Eat the brute as it ripens. This, ladies and gentlemen, if you're just tuning in, this is a special New World Order investigation into the terrors of the Far East. Bryce, would it be possible to have two virgins pull me around and rich all naked? Did Martina send you? That cockroach still owes me from last time. It's Marker reporting from Thailand. Coming up, new cigarettes make you a cowboy. Millions of Chinese think so. We'll talk to Redwood Tobacco CEO Ken Silverman. But first, let's take some calls. Hello. Yeah, Dwayne, man. Hell, you got a great show. Uh, I wanted to ask, what's the deal with the one dollar bill? What do you mean? Well, there's an eyeball on top of a pyramid, and it says, and we just it. I just tell if that eyeball don't creep me out enough. It's Latin, I think. Well, they should keep foreign languages off of our money. I mean, pretty soon we'll all speak Latin. So what are you going to do then? I'm tired of seeing languages I don't understand on signs or people speaking funny. It's not American! What do you do? I'm a customs and immigration official. What, the hell what are you going to do about the Latin minute? Probably go to commercial messages. Oh, I can't. This is public radio. Well, let's have a pledge drive or something. <laughs> you cheap. Corporal Vance, would you care to explain why there's marijuana hidden under your bed? And who the Sam Hill is this? Hey, buddy. Listen, I charge more for groups. You brought a whore onto the base? Have you no shame, boy? Are you a moron? Is that it? Drugs, whores, you're out of here, soldier. You're a disgrace! no good, the bathroom stink, and the money don't work. India is in the news again. Streets riddled with elephant dung and snake charmers, food that gives you gas, an unhealthy respect for the cow, and a caste system that nobody understands. Chuck Summers is in New Delhi. Thanks, Dwayne. Despite its name, the city is nothing like a deli, except the food is old and the coffee tastes like armpit. India is an ancient culture, and it shows. Sweaty hordes of yogi folk waft about chanting Om and giving that smug look that comes with inappropriate stretching in public. I learned quickly not to show your teeth when at the monkey temples. It makes the monkeys angry. But I didn't come here to get in feces bugs. I've got a little Brazilian waiter I do that with on Friday nights back at home when my wife is out playing bridge. These cocky contortionists aren't just a threat to our convenience stores back in America. There's a bigger threat looming on the horizon. 